welcome back to Precious Daughters. My name is Savannah with Precious Daughters and today I am going to be showing you a care package that I am making. So um, I have a really good friend in Arizona who is having a baby. Yay! And it's her first baby and since I've already had two babies and I've done two hospital births, I kind of have an idea about what you're going to need for the hospital. Um, so for from a two-time mom to a first-time mom, I thought I would send her like a little care package to help her get through kind of the monotony that the hospital can be. So let's get started before we do. I just want to say thanks for coming back to the channel. If you're new, don't forget to like and subscribe and please make sure you like the video so we can get more views. Also, leave a comment if you want to see some more projects that I'm currently working on. So to get started, the first thing I got her was this blue two pocket folder. Um, and then I put little sticky notes on everything to explain why I got her what I got her. So this says, I'm gonna actually switch it around because it's been a long time. It says, you will get a ton of paperwork, keep it together. And it's true. They give you like birth certificates, they give you shot records, they give you pretty much everything. So you need a lot of stuff. Um, and then to go along with that, I got her some fuzzy socks. They have grippies on the bottom. Um, mostly because you're not going to be wearing shoes a lot and it says hospitals are cold and the floors are gross and it's true. The floors in the hospital are gross. Don't walk around barefoot. Don't walk around in socks that you're going to take home and wear again. These were from the dollar store. She can probably throw these away after they're done and I'm not going to be heartbroken over that. Then to help, I also got her a thing of hair ties and a little hair scrunchy thingy. And it says you can never have enough hair ties because you lose those all the time. I do at least. I have like 5,000 of them. And I said I got her some Blistex chapstick. And it says hospitals are also really cold. And they have dry air. So some Blistex for that. I got her two puzzles. So I got her this one. It's the Eiffel Tower. And then I got her another one. It's like a farm village scape. Um, this is actually what the back looks like. And this one is 300 pieces. And I got little sticker says, hospitals are boring and their cable sucks. It really does. Really does. And then on that, I also got her an adult coloring book with little like diagrams like that. Um, a set of colored pencils. And a crossword puzzle, and it says, and another sticky that says, "No, really, you're gonna be super bored." So, got her that, and then I also got her a set of pens, like three gel black pens, to uh, for the for the book. Also, you're gonna be signing a lot of paperwork. You're gonna be doing a lot of stuff like that. So it kind of helps to have all of that with you. I also got her a tumbler that has um, a little infuser in it, so you can put like fruit or lemon or lime in there and you can still drink your water. This holds up about 20 ounces and said you need between 80 to 100 ounces of water a day to breastfeed. So drink up buttercup. And I uh, got her that. So I'm going to put all of this together in the box and show okay, you how so that. I am just using one of these priority flat rate boxes. I have a ton of these in my house. Whenever I go to the post office I always get like five or six of them extra from what I need just because you never know when you're going to need a flat rate shipping box and they're the best. So I have everything in here. Um, I have her coloring books and stuff on the bottom. I have her puzzles in here, all of her little knickknacks in this. The blue folder is like really almost too big for the box, so I'm gonna have to like cram that in there last. And then I also got her a, um, a little baby gift, it's a little onesie. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw that on top of here and this is all set to go. So this is a really good idea for anyone who is going to be hospitalized, who's having surgery, who's on bed rest. Um, it's just kind of endless and like no joke, I got everything from the Dollar Tree. So this whole thing didn't cost me more than $15. Um, and I just think it's like a really sweet sentimental thing to do from the heart. All right, guys, that's my video for the week. I hope you guys liked seeing kind of like a thoughtful craft that I did for a friend. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe if you're new to the videos. You can also hit that notification bell so you can see whenever I upload. I usually upload every Wednesday and Friday. Um, go ahead and check it out. I have some more stuff coming up soon. We're going to be doing some recipes. We're going to be doing some packing. We're going to be doing some crafts. We're going to get my craft on. It's going to be great. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much for coming back.